Hey everybody, welcome back to another quick guide video. Today we are looking at mirror carp. Now mirror carp are with the second heaviest fish on the Aguas Claris Reserve, one of the biggest fish in the game. Uh, so you're gonna need a pretty hefty setup for these guys. We're just gonna get right into it here. Um, you know, I have a goal. My biggest goal is 39 pounds. Diamond gets even bigger. So have your biggest setup ready if you want to target the big mirror carp. Um, they prefer shallow lakes, deep lakes, and upriver places. So if you want to go look for your own hot spots, those are some places to go look for there. Um, cheese, dough, red worm are their top three preferences. Uh, we could also use hot dog for them. Cheese, cheese and red worm, I think I personally have had the most uh, luck with on these guys, but cheese for sure. Uh, you do get a lot of different stuff with cheese, though, so just keep that in mind. Now, as far as hook size goes, if you want the diamond only, that's going to be a 3 aught hook. So that's the 3-0. If you're not familiar with that term, the 3-0 hook size, that is going to be what you want if you only want gold-sized mirror carp. Um, if you want golds and diamonds, you could use a 2 aught, so the 2-0 slash hook size. Um, if you want, you know, pretty much any size of, you know, mirror carp, you are going to want to go smaller than that. And remember, you know, the big fish will also bite on the smaller hook sizes too. So we do know that. Just want to confirm that, reiterate that, because I do get a lot of comments saying like, well, my di a diamond bit on a size six hook. Yes, that will happen. Uh, we know that. Uh, just saying if you only want the diamonds and you don't want the small fish, the small fish won't bite on the bigger hook sizes. I hope that was more clear. <laughs> so we'll go into the hot spots here. I only have a couple spots marked. I've got... I've had a lot of people tell me some different places. They've got uh, diamond mirror carp around here. But I'm going to highlight four places that I've seen repeatedly people get diamond mirror carps out of. Or I've had people who I trust uh, tell me that it is, in their opinion, a hot spot. And the first two spots I've already covered. Uh, this spot here, you know, you can fish all the way. Kind of, if you just fish this whole area for a while, you'll get a diamond mirror carp. Uh, this dam spot, I've seen countless people. There's a dam right here in this dark spot right here. Cast in this area, I've seen countless people get diamond mirror carp from this area. Uh, down here, I've seen mirror carp pulled out here to all the way to here. Really just in this general area, um, I've seen a pretty good spot for diamond mirror carps. And I've got some big golds there too. Um, and then this river spot up here um, has... I've seen people tell me that people that I trust tell me that there's uh, you can get diamond mirror carp there. I've not seen that personally, um, but the anglers that I trust have said that is a good mirror carp spot. So those are some spots to check out if you're just now getting into um, the Spain Reserve, the Spain DLC. Uh, that's some good places to look if you're looking for mirror carp. Uh, there are plenty of other places. There's some other places on this lake you can check out too. I believe here and here I've seen people talk about as well as good mirror carp spots. But uh, let me know where your mirror carp spot is in the comments. Uh, if this was helpful, leave a like. Uh, if you have any questions, also leave those in the comments. I'll get back to those as soon as I can. And go ahead and subscribe if you want to see more quick guides like this. And I'll catch you in the next one.